Hello and welcome all to what I'm sure is going to be an unmissable game. Here's the key information. We have a side looking to make it into the exclusive knockout stage of the competition. A victory does it, but anything less than that could lead to all sorts of complications. Everybody is ready to go once we have the formalities out of the way. This is the gladiatorial arena that is the Stadio Olimpico, for so long the symbol of Rome's grand sporting history. Germany are a team on a mission. Maximum points, and they're on to bigger and better things. Well, Peter, the, the question that comes to mind is how much do they want it? These players know that this could be the gateway for, for bigger things. Progression for starters brings greater financial reward, it increases the brand power and can enhance the whole business side of things. Individual player profile elevation is also a huge incentive. Careers can be catapulted from this. It's worth remembering. We have already started here. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Yeah, Joshua Kimmich. In many ways, the ultimate modern fullback in that he contributes just as much offensively as he does defensively. He seems to have a great instinctive understanding of when to move forward, and, and that means he rarely gets caught out of position on the counter-attack. He should be a key player for this team. Yes, getting the best out of him will count for so much. Well, he's looking at the referee, but the referee is shaking his head. And it's Tony Kroos. Keepers in command. Jujak. Forward it goes. Ginter gets into the right position to intercept. Going through. Big chance. Must be. It's a loose ball. Driving on now. What can they conjure from here? Now it's Canabri. He's on his way. Tries to get it clear. Well, I don't think it was the wisest option, Peter, once he got into that position. It's not as if he didn't have people nearby. It's one! Oh, that is very close. Yeah, the shot was enabled, Peter, due to such smart control and technique. Germany, so far, providing no real test at all for the goalkeeper. And that's put paid to a promising move. Gnabry. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. He's got through, he's got away. Has a goal! Oh, that's a fine save! Gnabry is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Shall I? He's through. No question, that's a foul. Talking to, I think. Yes, it is. And the finish! Gundawan plays it forward. Tony Kroos. Is there any support? He might not need it. A reprieve, albeit perhaps momentary. He's left his man. In for a header. Oh, just couldn't turn it in. I have to commend the wing play, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. The referee's awarded a free kick. Put 
a stop to that. Shall I? Well positioned to make that interception. And it's Jujak. And it's played forward. That's ruffled a few feathers, but well dealt with. Plays it long. Kimmich. Werner. Gnabry. Oh, it's Gundogan. Chance to break. And here's Shalloy. Now it's Jujak. Gets away from his opponents. Goes for goal. Goal! Hungary! And right on half time. That is telling. Yeah, looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Hungary have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? And the finish! Yes, it's there! They have done it! They have their equaliser! Pretty simple finish in the end, what do you think, Jim? Yeah, and teamwork was key to that. A beautiful piece of uh, engineering to, to set him free in the box. And the half-time whistle goes, what it has been, an even contest, as the scoreline suggests, and it has been more than decent to watch. So we reach the halfway point. Who wants half-time when you have a contest this good? I can only hope it picks up where it left off. Well, it's been a decent 45 minutes, competitive certainly, and a goal each. We're promptly into the second 45 minutes. No changes at half-time that we're aware of. Werner goes for goal! Oh, that was nice, but not quite the end product required. Well, there are a few pockets of space that are being exploited, and they need filling, and fast. Gnabry. Good ball. Werner gets the better of his man. Goalkeeper's ball. Laps exploited with glee. Hungary go into the lead. Tony Kroos. Gundawan. Chance! Whistle's gone and the referee has given a penalty. And that is a huge moment in the context of the game. Well, it was deliberate, it was cynical, and you have to understand the frustration of, of being denied a clear opportunity, but it had to be done. To square things up. Good save, really well read. Well, it's always worrying that the psyche is affected after a, a missed penalty. That's gone a long way up and away. And that's been won straight back. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He's got options out wide. 
Werner. He gets past his man. That's a look. That's it! That's good distance on it. Tries to get it forward quickly. Uh, ball needed to be better there. It's a wasted chance. Gnabry is on the end of some really unwanted attention. Yeah, and they finally reacted, but they could have been more switched on before he, he scored. Well, this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. Well, Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of needs must. Just has to be done. Well weighted. Shall I? That's just an example of overcommitting, and they're fortunate for the quality of the intervention. It was vital. And it's Canabri. He's pinged one through here. Werner. He's gone for it! Chooses to go back. Well, the crowd clearly liked what they just saw. Some real no-nonsense defending. It's out for a goal kick. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real on a shift. Delicate ball. This is good ball retention, and it should be enough from here, but they want to double their advantage. Well, they could break here. Kivik. Well positioned to make that interception. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Gundawan. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool. Now that's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. And that's going to be a booking. Challenge, but fair enough. I think it's time for them to concentrate on closing this one out. And here's Shalai. He's found his man. Hungary can afford to settle on seeing this one out by running down the clock, I think. And here's Chuchak. Plays it out to the flank. And helps available out wide. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. And the referee has shown him a yellow card. Players protesting furiously, but there's little or no sympathy from the ref. Cuts it out. That's it! They are out. The worst possible outcome. They barely got going, and now, at the earliest opportunity, they are going out. Your reflections then, Jim.
Well, it all came down to this, and they had to produce to ensure qualification, and they've not delivered. I think looking back over the campaign,